What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Demon Slayer Season 3 is here on a Terabyte Reacts. If you guys want to watch Demon Slayer, <laughs> okay? If you want to watch Demon Slayer, of course the original episodes, Season 1 and 2, I will leave a link in the description. But if you are watching this on Terabyte Reacts, I highly recommend you guys go and subscribe to my anime channel, which is TBR Anime. I will be posting Demon Slayer on Terabyte Reacts as well. But it's just because I know that a lot of the anime fans that have been with me for a long time, they still don't know that I have a specific anime channel now, <laughs> right? Which I've been trying to build up. It's not many people over there right now, but I, as I said, I will be posting this over there, but I will be telling you guys about this channel. Now, let's talk about Demon Slayer Season 3. I did see the trailer. Um, this is called the Sword, Swordsmith Village <laughs> Arc. <laughs> so, some, I think it's Swordsmith Village Arc. I think this one is called. Um, of course, we're going to get to see some of the new um, Hashiras in action. Well, not some, not the new Hashiras, but um, some of the ones that we got introduced to, but we never saw them in action. Um, as this lady over here, and I think this is the one that became a Hashira in like three months or some crazy shit that they talked about at the end. I think at the end of, I think they talked about it at the end of season two. They talked, uh, or somebody referenced. Um, I think this is the one I'm thinking because looks the youngest might be the sauciest who knows right we still don't know much about all the the we don't know much about the Hashiras we know what what they kind of use but that's about it so it's gonna be cool to see two new Hashiras get a little shine in the story I'm here for it um, this is the best background that I could have found for season three that fits me and what i'm trying to do so <laughs> here we are so yeah man i'm ready to jump in hopefully you guys are ready too as i said before i am going to be dropping the episodes early um on sundays okay because the, the episodes are coming out so as soon as they come out i'm going to react to the episodes and then i'm going to drop the episode on patreon if you guys want to watch the episode full no interruption well not interruptions but no blockage you know nothing like that you can go watch the episode on patreon you can sign up and watch the episode as soon as it drops i will post it on patreon so you'll get to watch it fully don't have to worry about anything um and then if you want to watch if you want to wait until i edit these episodes and put them up on youtube which is probably not going to be not going to come out until like monday that's fine too <laughs> you know if you want to wait that's cool but i'm saying you can watch the episodes early on sunday because i will be reacting to this when the episodes drop it's just that i might not get a time to edit the episodes and put them up on sunday so they might be a day late so without no further ado let's jump into season three of demon slayer and i will see you guys right after for the review let's go The soul blemish on my family. I wonder if they're related. Man's the upper three. There's two other people stronger than this dude. <laughs> Ooh. 
Do they have to like find their way to where they need to meet or something? Like, chill, you foldable. You ain't gotta go so hard, man. <laughs> Photobit is like, there's no competition, my guys. We out here. Up a four. ハンティング。ああ、これ They really don't like each other, do they? いい拳だ。上限の位置様は最初にお呼びしました。ずっとそこにいらっしゃいますよ。Wait a second. This looks like it looks a lot like Tanjiro's dad, ain't it? The hair? Yutaro ga shinda. Jougen no tsuki ga kaketa. So who's gonna get promoted or? Yutaro wa ore ga shoukai shita mono yue. Dono yo ni oabi itashimasho. Medama o hojikuri itashimasho ka? Sore tomo? Shitsuyou nai. <笑>初めから牛太郎が戦っていれば勝っていた <laughs> あおい悲願花はどうした。なぜ何百年も見つけられぬ。返す言葉もない。うぶやしき。巧妙に姿を隠している。あなた様の望みに一歩近づくための情報を私は伝えました。私が嫌いなものは変化だ。私が好きなものは普遍完璧な状態で永遠に変わらないこと。百十三年ぶりに上限を殺されて、私は不快の絶頂だ。いや、did お前たちを甘やかしすぎたようだ。教えてくれないか。この通りだ。赤座。どうですか。お前に何か命じたか。うせろ。赤座。よ。お前はどがすぎる。よいよい隠し棒だな。あれがのショーイスフェイス。ヒストンディアーキーウィチンズ。従属関係に日々が。あ、わざと良けなかったんだよ。上に立つものは下のものにそう目くじら立てず、ゆとりを持つ。赤座。私の言いたいことは。Why do you have six eyes? Oreaka. 
Yo! お茶が入りましたよ。あ、ありがとう。本当に申し訳ない。客人にこもりをさせてしまって。ゲス。気にするな。疲れているのだろう。これを飲んだら私は出ていく。ただで飯を食い続けるのも忍びない。あなたがい
ドジさんはなぜ鬼殺隊に入ったんですか私間もなく刀が研ぎ終わるそうです最後の調整のため工房の方へ来ていただきたく炭治郎君今度また生きて会えるかわからないけど頑張りましょうね実際に体感して得たものはこれ以上ないほど価値がある5年分10年分の修行に匹敵する観路寺光はかまど兄弟を応援してるよ<笑>もっともっと頑張ります鬼仏寺無残に勝つために、うん、この里には強くなるための秘密の武器があるらしいの探してみてねじゃあねハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ連絡すると言づかっております。それ,それまで体力をつけて、静養してください。はい、ありがとうございます。すごいな、いい加減にしろ。君こそいい加減にしなよ。押し問答している時間がもったいないだろう。なんて言ってたっけ、しのぶさん。なんだか知らないけど、勝手なんだよ。そうだ。早くどっか行けよ。霞柱。時と無一郎。ほら、鍵。渡さない。これは俺の先祖が作った大事なものなんだ。What is it? 一緒にもう一人誰かいるのか。バカ人。誰だろう。これはですね。知ってる。俺。見覚えがある。What is going on? Cause we know it's not. Oh man. There's a lot I want to go back and talk about here while I'm recording my review. I didn't know that this was going to be like a, a one hour premiere. I didn't know that. But I want to go back.、Um, all right. So we met the upper one. They even showed, I thought they were going to not show what he looks like. But. I know it's not this guy, right? I you know it's not Kokoshi, Kokoshi Buro, whatever. <laughs> I have to learn to say that, right? Then we have this guy, right? That shows up. Now, this guy and that guy must be related. Somehow, some way, these two people are related. They made sure. To the way how they show these characters from the back. And it looked like that dude, Kokoshiburo, <laughs> Kokoshiburo, right? It seems like he's a former Hashira. That's what I'm thinking. Former Demon Slayer, Hashira, whatever. It seems like he's a former Demon Slayer because that's what I'm thinking. That he must be some sort of former swordsman, former demon slayer. That's what I'm thinking. And he got turned, and that's why he's probably upper one because he's so damn powerful. Now, he could be related to this dude, but there's also the flashback from season two. When, um, There's also the flashback from season two. I can't even remember her name. Daki. I think it's Daki, right? She, when she was fighting Tanjiro, Tanjiro got serious and she remembered something happening. She, she remembered, because he's like, this is not my memory. This seems like somebody else's memory, which I can only assume that this is Muzan's memory because they, you know, it's his blood that makes them strong. Right? And it seemed like at the time, if I can. If, it, listen, I'm just putting the theories together, trying to put the puzzle pieces together here because they revealed a lot in the first part of this episode. A lot. And now it appears that he's here with the Miss Hashira that I was telling you guys, I don't know who the hell he is. Now he appears here? 
this this dude should be hella old right like if he was if this is the same guy and and he has the the earrings as well because i was thinking that maybe these earrings were passed down to tanjiro from his father because we saw him with we saw him with the earrings and i'm pretty sure that flashback that we got right where his father was talking to this 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 person here i have no idea who he is um but i think that this person and the upper one gotta be related they look too much alike in stature in the hair you get what i'm saying this is crazy because we learned a lot about the history the lore i should say behind a lot of things in season two um especially when it comes on to um that one time when when tanjiro had went to go you know visit um um rengoku's dad and he was like oh the the son all hashiras all the 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 all the other types of hashiras and styles that they have is comes from sun breathing right it comes it all derives from sun breathing right which is what tanjiro is blending with his water with his water breathing right he's blending it together trying to make it work together because he knows how to do the the um the hero hero kami here whatever there's so many things to remember about this anime is i have a a love hate <laughs> relationship with this series man but of course we gotta mention the titties <laughs> we gotta mention the titties because you know it's it's just it's just good decorum <laughs> you know what I'm saying? we gotta mention them give them so um of course this hashira um i can't wait to see them in action you know in my opinion i can't wait to see them in action because it's always an exciting thing to see how these hashiras fight um i quietly don't know what they were arguing about seeing the miss hashira that i found that they reveal that it's miss hashira that we saw there um talking to a swordsmith um asking for it seems like for some secret something that's being held in their family for years i wonder if i don't know why they want it or you know what what's going on i don't know what that conversation was about right so there's a lot to to dive into when it comes on to the series this was great this was a great opening um they decided to go with a double episode open i believe this is what people got to see early in theaters i think i don't know maybe like a few weeks ago or a month ago or something like that they got to see like this what they they got to see um in theaters or whatever i'm not paying money to go to go watch something like demon and it's not a movie it's not a movie and it's not something that i'm you know what i'm saying like it's not a movie like they're just pre um um screening the the first two episodes of the of season three but you could just wait right so i wasn't gonna do that i did hear about it but i was like i'm not doing that <laughs> uh, i don't even think if it i don't think it was even available in miami um i probably should have checked but as i said i didn't really have any interest in actually doing it anyways but i did hear that a lot of people got to see the first two episodes um of demon slayer early or the first episode or whatever because they're still calling this just one episode right so great fine um whatever they choose to do but this was great it was good we got to see all five remaining of the of the upper ranks all oh, five of them look really interesting. Kokoshibo, Kakoshibo, <laughs> whatever his name is, looks sauce. And he's son in Akaza. So you know he's the shit. You know what I'm saying? What's his name? Do Dota? Doka? I, I don't remember his name. Okay? That, let, I'm just going to put it like that. I don't remember his name. But as we go along, I'm going to get used 
to their names because they're really just being introduced into the story and we've just seen their names for the first time so we're not i'm not going to remember that just from you know hearing it one time you know it's going to take me a while to get there okay but at least we met them of course muzan super angry for no reason <laughs> you know what i'm saying <laughs> you get real emotional <laughs> i'm just kidding i'm just making fun of this dude um but it, the atmosphere that they set with the OST and everything that they were doing during that scene of the meeting of the upper ranks with Muzan, that was that was done really good. And that's why I say that when it comes on to Ufotable, I always give them praise because I don't know what other projects they have out there, but we know that Demon Slayer is their baby. We know that Demon Slayer, there's a certain standard that we expect at this point when it comes on to Demon Slayer, that if the quality drops, everybody's gonna be talking about it because they're the standard right now. When it comes on to animation, they're the standard. They are the standard. Um, love me some Mappa, but Mappa ain't touching you foldable. I'm sorry. They might have a lot, Mappa has a lot of shows, but when it comes on to animation, high quality animation, that's going on right now. Ufotable is the studio that just makes everything dazzle animation. They blend 3D. Um, they blend three um 3D and also they blend everything work together. They, they blend the 2D, 2D with the 3D um um backgrounds, um, a lot of the um of course the CG is really good they know how to blend that stuff together to make them work sometimes a lot of times the 2d really does stand out um but i didn't have any issue there was a lot of cg in this in this episode in the first part of it and it didn't bother me one bit it looks really good everything blend together in really well so and that's one of the things that they do so well that it's like unnoticeable at times but if you you know if you know what to look for you you will notice it it's not stand out like regular people that watch this anime that knows that really doesn't know anything about animation are not going to really notice bad cgi they might look at it and be like oh well that's just what it is right but either way this was great i enjoyed it um they did a very good job man it, that was an eerie meeting man like the whole time i was on edge during that scene because you know muzan he don't play no games Cause he's like he's starting to wonder if it's even worth having them around because they're not delivering on anything it's been 113 years since they met because it's been 113 years since the last time that an upper rank died but apparently it doesn't seem like they replaced them very often because it's just like he didn't really put anybody in place he just sent them out to some places to go you know they have leads on whatever the situation is, whatever they're looking for the the blue lily something in there i can't remember what he calls some blue lily of some sorts he's looking for and i'm wondering if that thing is going to allow him to like um walk in daylight because i think that's one of his weaknesses if i'm correct right or is he the only one that can walk in daylight and no none of the other demons can i don't remember exactly how it goes with him but um or his powers because they don't showcase it that very much i think we just heard it in passing but i don't think he can i think he's trying to get that thing so that he can walk in daylight like the like the um like the demon slayers and and stuff i i'm i'm just talking out my ass i, I have no idea what's going on <laughs> you know what i'm saying like i'm just trying to follow the story as close as possible it's not a hard story to follow because everything is just in time to re to reveal because you know in this story there's nothing super deep you know what i'm saying this is not attack on titan so um but either way man great opening i loved it hopefully you guys enjoyed it as well enjoyed my reaction as i've told you as i've told you guys as you're watching this video and watching this video was out yesterday on patreon or earlier today depending on which day you get this <laughs> you get this episode um on youtube so make sure you go check it out man over on the patreon link is down in the description it drops trust me it's gonna drop hours earlier or even a day earlier on patreon okay so make sure you go check it out that's where the full reactions will 
um will be you will have access to the full reaction off these episodes as they as they come out as well but if you want to see them early and you don't want to wait until i get to editing these episodes go check it out on the patreon guys it's a great community over there go check it out all right i'll see you guys next week peace